guys, it's Sarah. I'm here with Oil Life, and we have Anthony here from Neo Tools. Hello. We love having them here. We do all sorts of awesome DIYs with them. So today we are talking about our Christmas sprays, right? Yes. So it's crazy Christmas. A little early. Why are we talking about Christmas right now? Yeah, that's a good question, and it, and it is it is early. But you got to remember, it's October now. It's the middle of October. You want to have people are going to want to do these things. You're going to want to make them for gifts. They're going to want to have them made. Send mail them out if they have to, or give them away. So you want to have your class in November, right. right? So that people can come, they can get their sprays made, and have them ready for Christmas. And we're planners. You know, right. we, we like to plan things out. We like of to be course. plenty in advance. So so we like to, we like you guys to be that right. way as well. So yes. that's why we do it so early. Yeah. Speaking of gifts, we have a gift for two lucky winners today. Okay, we will be doing our giveaway. <coughs> Excuse me. We will be giving away um, a 12 Spirits of Christmas kit. Make it take kit. Yep. Make it take kit as well as a tear pad. Sheet. Yes, the so, tear pad sheet. Yeah. Yes, we'll be giving away both of those. So make sure you are responding to our questions on here and sharing our videos. So all you have to do is share it and comment to be entered to win one of those two yes. awesome things. So yeah. definitely do that. Uh, to get started, I will ask you what kind of essential oil gifts do you like to give out for Christmas? So have you made DIYs? you picked up something from our store. What kind of gifts do you like to give during Christmas time that have to do with essential oils? Tell us. Okay, let's get going. Tell me a little bit All more right. about the Christmas uh, kit. Okay, yeah, so it's the 12, it's called the 12 sprays of Christmas, and uh, it is actually the only Christmas room spray make and take on the market. Okay. So yeah, we came out with it last year, uh, last year, year before last year, and it just, we do it every year and it goes crazy. People absolutely love it because they make great gifts, these sprays Definitely. themselves. You know, whether it just be one or you give a whole set of 12, they make great gifts. And the reason, one of the reasons that this is uh, so popular is you guys see those little, the plug-ins and the scented candles. Right. Those are chock full of candles. Like you okay. just, you don't, we don't anyway. We don't like those plugged in in our house. Uh, we don't like the candles burning. We use these. We use these room sprays. They're safe, they're effective, uh, and they, and you can make them yourself, right? right? And they're, they're, we're safe having them around our kids around pets or on other people's kids, so. And they smell good. They do. They smell great. They do, they um, do. Question, question for you guys actually, what is your favorite Christmas smell? Because I will say mine personally is the smell of like pine, like yes. pine trees, like when you have your Christmas tree in your house. Yes. But do you like, you know, gingerbread? What, what's your favorite Christmas smell? And maybe we actually have a spray for you, so. Yeah. Keep yeah. watching. Yeah, and I'll talk, so, so just to let you know a little bit about the sprays, that's a good uh, segue into this. There are woodsy aromatic profiles, which you would love. I do right. as well, by the way. Yeah. Uh, so carols by the fire, dashing through the pines. I think you would love. I would love that. Yeah. <laughs> Gifts of the Magi and Tannenbaum Forest. Those are all so great. Yeah. And then we have spicy aromatic profiles. Okay. So gingerbread cookies, spiced hot cider, vanilla spice, which is another very uh, nice one actually. And then warm spice chai. So think of your your chai coffee, your chai tea that you go over. Mm. And then we have your classic aromatic profile, so Christmas potpourri, right? Okay. Get rid of that plug-in and get the spray. Right. The spray uh, back yep. Down. Holy Night, Merry and Bright, and Peppermint. Okay. And the other great thing that you can do with these, and actually I should have pulled out, but you can get those little quarter drams that you guys sell, and instead of doing the sprays or along with the sprays, make diffuser bombs. So That's take the idea. recipes, just put the oils in there, have them set right by your diffuser. When you're ready for a refill, pull, pull it up, dump it in. Add the water, nice. you're ready to go. Yeah. Okay, great. Yeah, so those are those are great. Okay. okay. So we're doing a um, DIY today, right? Yes. DIY Tuesday. So what's the DIY that we're making? Yeah, so we're gonna make two of them. We're gonna make the peppermint stick room spray, and we're gonna make the dashing dashing through the pines room spray. And uh, we do have, a, as you can see, we do have a little bit of a setup here. And I'll just tell you real quickly that when you buy the make and take kit, what you are getting, you're getting 20 of the invitations, and they are double-sided so you Love can fill those. those out hand them out yep you're getting 10 of the recipe sheets you're gonna get actually 11 of the label sheets so one for you and then one for 10 of your guests okay and then you're gonna get the table tent so one for each spray and those just pop up and fold right exactly okay. exactly gotcha. and those are to put in your stations which we'll talk about next and of course you can get the lid stickers uh, separately okay. you guys have those as well awesome. yeah and those are those are fun especially for the diffuser bombs so yeah Okay. So what we recommend when you're doing the class is you set up 12 different stations that look similar to this. So you, and this is how, this is our recommended pricing right. for them, but you know, you can do it however you want. You can change you it, how you Absolutely. Do it. Okay. But so people will come in, they'll tell you I want to make all 12. So you give them their 12 empty clear bottles. 
Uh, and then you set up stations. So we have one right here for Gifts of the Magi. And we have all the oils for Gifts of the Magi. We have a sample so that they can smell it. Right. And then we have these cotton balls there. Okay. And basically what they do with those, you just kind of pull one out. You'll like this one. Okay, give them a, a good shake and then spray it in there. Mm, smell I really spray. like that one. Yeah, that's a nice one. And then of course your oils. And this little squirt bottle just has distilled water in okay. there, which is what you want to use, distilled right. water. Okay, okay. okay. so easy. let's make some demos. So we're gonna make peppermint stick here. So we have a two ounce clear spray bottle and I already put the label on there because we don't wanna get oil on the right. bottle or else your label won't stick. Won't stick right? yeah. And you can actually get these kind of bottles here at Oil Life. Yes, so that's yeah, you really guys have nice. great prices and good quality by the way. You can find them that aren't very good quality. You can, your quality is top of the line. Oh, thank at you. Oil Life. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we love it. Okay, so we're gonna start with fur, white fur or, or any, uh, it could be a balsam fur if you prefer. Right, and whatever you might have. Exactly. And so there's three drops in of that. Okay, and then orange and two drops of orange. And I want to show you, he's got the table tent Oh, yes. Up, and I think these are really cute when they're all popped up. I love the design on them. And these match the stickers, they match. So all this kind of goes together. It's super cute. And they're reusable too. So once right. you, if you have the class, say, in the beginning of November, and then you want to have it again in the middle of November, mm -hmm. just go ahead and go on oillife.com, order more recipe sheets and more label sheets, and you're good you're to go good. with the rest of it. Yeah. That's great. And the last thing we're going to do is five drops of peppermint. So. Okay, so there we go. And then we'll take our distilled water and you just fill it right here. Just all the way up to the top. Yes. Right. So we're making, you know, I'm not gonna fill it up because we're making a little bit of a mess. But you get the <laughs> point. You, you fill it up and then you shake it to emulsify it. And I do recommend because oil and water, they separate. Mm -hmm. So definitely shake it to emulsify it and uh, you're good to go with that one. That's awesome, okay. that's easy. Yeah, super easy, super fun. People are gonna love it. It's real quick. I now we're gonna smell do, it, I'm like, mm, I know, yeah, right? I know. it just really hits you in the face. I love good it stuff. too. So now we're gonna do bashing through the pines. Okay, okay? So my favorite one. I think we're gonna go with fur. Okay, so we have the white fur here and it's six drops of this. And if you're asking me, you, you can't get enough white fur right. in something. And four drops of the cypress, which goes fantastic with the fur. And then one drop of your cedar wood. Okay. Which is a thicker one. A little bit so, slower. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's definitely thick. And you guys could use those droppers that you guys have. You guys uh -huh. makes it a little bit easier. Just have a take the orifice reducer out, have a dropper in there, and do it that way. It definitely makes it go a little quicker. And then the same thing. We're just gonna. Are we gonna get lucky here with this one? You might. Let's see. We are. Oh. Okay. Right up to the top there with that. Spray top on, give it a little shake, and you're good to go. That's easy. So dashing through the pines, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So I want to know which one of these looks the best to you. Which one of these room sprays do you need to make for your make and take class? Yes. Um, and also maybe what, uh, maybe which is your favorite oil from all these? Because I think my favorite Christmas oil would be some of the some of the more woodsy ones yeah. because they do remind me of like that pine smell. They do, right? right? Yeah, yeah. But I know a lot of people love peppermint. A lot of people love orange or if you do you know orange and cassia it smells like the christmas yes. orange yeah like the, the chocolate yeah. orange the so. peppermint stick the feedback that we get peppermint stick seems to be the majority favorite. okay yeah okay so yeah. let us know let me know yeah let's see what you what guys you think. like yeah and remember we're doing that giveaway today we will be giving away a uh 12 series of christmas kit uh, to one winner, and then we'll be giving away to a second winner the tear pad. Yes, the tear pad, and you can see the tear pad here, and it is double sided. And one tear pad comes with 25 sheets on there, and there's some fun facts on there, some biblical quotes mentioning said, oils. There's a uh, a lip balm recipe on there, a couple of other recipes. It's a great supplement for the class. class so you just need right. one. The one tear pad will actually probably last you at least two classes. Right. So. Yeah. So for those of you that join late, remember all you need to do is share this video and leave us a comment and you'll be entered to win. So Perfect. that's awesome. Anything else you want to tell them before I we go? Think, uh, I think I think we got it. I think we did. Yeah. Yes. So again, we love these. They smell great and you definitely want to get on buying these and have your class in November because these are great as gifts, right? Yes. Yes. So, 
take advantage of that. Lots of awesome sprays that you can make and the link for all this great stuff is actually in the description of this video. So click on that. Thanks for joining us today, guys. Thank See you, you later.